Starman Podcast. Hello and welcome to another Starman Debates. I am your host, Devin. With me is Cody, Billy, and David. Hey guys. Woo! Greetings to everyone. And guys, we're just going to pick up from the last talk to talk. And we were talking at the end there about comic books. And how crazy that universe is. Uh, your, your silence says it all. Yeah, I was like, I don't feel I need to take drugs. I think comic books <laughs> can do that for me. Or comic books can tell you not to take drugs. Yes, actually, I kind of want to talk about this. Let's talk about PSAs. Oh, yes. <laughs> In those, that crazy world. <laughs> <laughs> so... If anyone hey. who doesn't know what a PSA is, it's a public service announcement, usually telling you not to do drugs, alcohol, or other things that the public service announcement wants you to be aware of. Play your heavy machinery. Yeah. Stay out of electrical power plants. Mm-hmm. And if you buy drugs, you, you, you go to the streets of hell. Yes. Or terrible. As- as, as told by Mario. Blue Albino. Yeah. <laughs> Your life know. goes to hell and then you die. Yeah. <laughs> I was really told that. I'm like, I have got to see that PSA. I mean. <laughs> what are you talking about? We showed you it one time, remember? Oh, that's what I said. Uh, after I, he said after we told him. He oh, got yeah. To see it. Yeah, like I just need to see <laughs> what. Yeah, why are you telling you your life will go to hell? No, you mean directly go to hell. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Oh, well, and Billy's favorite, Keep America Beautiful. No, oh, the, the... Crying the, Indian. Yeah, the Crying yeah. Indian. <laughs> Which wasn't really an Indian, he was an, an Italian guy. <laughs> Close oh. enough. <laughs> <laughs> five. You racist bastards. Oh, I actually watched the, the documentary of the old engine. That actually was a, Yeah. Because, um... Actually, uh, I'm not sure if you guys remember the... The guy who played that engine was also the, uh... The grandfather in, in Ernest Goes to Camp. Ah, okay. The one that Ernest talked to and commits to sell the camp. <laughs> so, for HUD PSAs, we'll start here. What ones stick out to you the most... Drugs, drugs, drugs. <laughs> Which are good. <laughs> oh my god, drugs, they played drugs. that drugs. step back in the day. <laughs> this is your brain. This is your brain on drugs. Which version of that? P.V. Herman. Mine was eggs. No, but one was a dude telling you that, and then they amped it up to a girl. It was who a then... dude. Okay. Because I the like one... the evolution of it, but... <laughs> The one, one you're thinking of is the girl who looks like crap. Yeah, and then just wrecks the house. <laughs> I don't remember that part. Yeah. Re- wrecks the house? I don't remember that. Yeah. That's probably because they shortened it. Yeah. Oh, wow. Like, I remember the long version of it where she just freaks out and wrecks everything. <gasps> <Yeah>. Oh! <laughs> With the frying pan. It was kind of funny. <laughs> oh, because she's like, this is your brain, this is your brain on crack. Yeah. And this is where it happens to your family life, she smashes the dishes. This is what happens to your friends, she breaks the cabin, and I was like, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll watch that later. Oh, yeah. <laughs> now, I, now I don't want to shorten it. No, show them the robot chicken sketch of that. Oh, yeah. They took that to, like, the next level. Oh. <laughs> Lady, we only want to help. <laughs> I gotta look this up. Holy so, crap. Billy's mentioned the Pee Wee Herman one. Now, my God, Pee Wee Herman knows about crack cocaine. <laughs> Makes yeah. too much sense to me. Yeah. <laughs> well, he knows a lot about a lot, so. What about Mr. T telling you not to do drugs? Oh, yeah, yeah. God. Mr. T is an angry person. I he makes me sick to my stomach. <laughs> but he loves his mama. Yeah. <laughs> 
I'd be like, okay, Mr. T doesn't want me to do drugs. No, calm down, Mr. T. I won't touch it. <laughs> Please don't kill me. It's like if you even touch it with one finger, he'd probably break your arm. Yeah. Yeah, that was the joke, Cody. Yeah. You took it too far again. Well, you ruined the joke. He explained the joke, so now there is no joke. joke. Thank you. <laughs> woo! No, no, no. Woo. <laughs> no woo! It's gonna be five across the eyes, Cody. And then ten across the ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> Uh, I don't think I want to ever touch my ass, thanks. No one wants to touch your ass, so you're safe. <laughs> Who said with my hand? Yeah. We're getting a Switch and smacking you with it. Not the Nintendo Switch. <laughs> piece of wood. Yeah. <laughs> and oh Cut. boy, will it make a sound. Yeah. Cut a Switch off with a hickory, Dave. Yeah. <laughs> The one I remember is the, it's a puppet one. Yeah. And the guy's like trying to sell these puppets, like, all these drugs. And they're like, no way, man. And they leave and they takes off his sunglasses. Sunglasses and it's like. The most scariest thing you would ever see as a child. <laughs> yeah, like the yellow eyes. He had like yellow bloodshot eyes. Oh, and wow. And like scars all around his eyes. <laughs> okay. Oh wow. PSAs take it pretty far, don't they? PSAs were here to scare children to not do drugs. <laughs> and also cause nightmares. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. <laughs> okay, another PSA you get that one should remember. The two puppets singing don't put it in your mouth. mouth. Well that's not really a drug one, but No, it's <laughs> So, Canada has some weird PSAs for different yeah, reasons. Yeah, because it's so... Hey. Oh, okay, oh what's only... the gift? It's a rape whistle. What? <laughs> Thanks, Grandma. Thanks. <laughs> oh, it's these uh, ladies are having a baby shower. Yeah. And the lady opens one of the gifts and pulls out a whistle. Yeah. And she, like this old lady just comes and it's like, it's a rape whistle. As like 9 out of 10... Canadian women get raped. Oh, oh wow. Yeah. <laughs> Way to kill the boo there, Grandma. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> like, that opened too many questions in my brain. I was like, so, are they preparing the baby because of rape? Or was the mom raped and that's why she's having a baby now? Oh, I never <laughs> thought... <laughs> no, I never thought of that one. I took it to a darker place, but I was like, it's possible that's what that means. Yeah. <laughs> the stupidest PSAs for me is when they try to compare when they refer to something but they use something else like well there's a recent one like a social smoker there was one where they said I'm a social farter oh yes yeah, god no or like a foodie yeah. instead of a whatever yeah, instead of a drug, it's a foodie. Like, yeah. they took a stupid concept yeah. Yeah. to show how stupid it is to say you're a casual drinker. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Speaking of the drinking ones, I love the freaking six cups. Yes, that's a good one. Too bad they ruined it later. By doing it in reverse. Which yeah, yeah, yeah which does not... <laughs> yeah, it kind of loses its point. Yeah. But yeah, that's kind of realistic, right? The more, you, the more you drink, the more your vision gets fucked up. Yeah. yeah. And I was always like, man, don't drink that sixth one. Don't drink oh, you drink the sixth one, we're gonna die! Oh, we're dead. <laughs> oh, fuck, we're all dead. dead. Get the fuck out. <laughs> and, and then there's the drinking one I saw where it's like mothers against drunk driving, I think. Yeah, man. And <laughs> cop at the door, tell... Telling family, oh, your uh, father and her husband was murdered, killed in a... Oh, oh yeah, they replaced the sound effect, and they put in, like, car sound effects. Yeah. Yeah, and, maybe, the, and, the, and the kids, kids crying, and, and yeah, that's that's the milk. milk. Yeah, that's the yeah. Cody. Huh. <laughs> you learn something every day, don't you? Yep. There you go.
But no, the one that you play constantly that you mentioned, the drugs, drugs, drugs song. Yeah. yeah. I was like, don't make a song of yeah. it. Yeah. Like, that's all you're the doing. The kid's going to remember is drugs, doing drugs, doing drugs. Some are good. <laughs> some are bad. Drugs, drugs, drugs. And like, hey kid, you want some drugs? Why don't that song go drugs, drugs, drugs? I guess that's it. So yes, yeah, drugs. Yeah, like, some, <laughs> some are good. Okay. Yeah. This got to be the good these must be the good ones. If you're not sure, just ask your mom or ask your dad. But if they're not around, use your best judgment. I'll take them. <laughs> yeah. Why would people make a song about it? That's gonna make them want to try that. Yeah. It was a catchy song that just kind of more promoted drugs in my mind. They didn't put much thought into it. I don't think. I don't think they put much fun in a lot of the PSAs. There's, there's one commercial. I, I don't even remember what's for it, but it had a like, animated picture of a train. I don't even remember what it was about. And it, it, that shows how effective it was. Yeah, but this is the trying to convince Cody to do something or not do something. Yeah. <laughs> Britain has some scary ones too. Yeah, the the power the line <laughs> one. Yes. Holy crap! So this one is uh, a bunch of kids see a football in a power plant area that's sealed off and like do not enter. And one of the kids goes in to retrieve the football and touches one of the cords and gets zapped. Yeah. And then the younger kid. Fault goes in to help him and touches something and gets zapped. Britain, you're killing kids left, right, and center. You're sick. Well, that's He's something. They sick. had a drug dog in one of their PSAs. Okay. Like, it's... it's like, Sarah got it's like... They sliced open the dog and hit drugs in it. Oh, yes, No! I remember this. This was so bad. <gasps> uh -huh. Like the guy talks to you about like how he's cut up and put drugs in him. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, okay, <laughs> like I get it. Trying to explain like how bad mm, he uses a drug mule against his yeah. will. Yeah. Fair enough. <laughs> the PSAs with the. It's not even one cartoon characters. That, yeah, that was one big one. Yeah, yeah. that was cartoon all stars. The best few. The Devin for the longest time was believed to be crazy for believing in that. Thing. Yeah. Yep, like, I mentioned that to several people, and they're like, "What are you talking that, about?" Yeah. I was like, "It was a cartoon that like said drugs are bad and had Winnie the Pooh, Alf, Chipmunks, Bugs uh, Bunny." Devin, we don't know what you're talking about. I'm not crazy <laughs> on this. <laughs> uh, I've never heard of this. Look it up. Cartoon All-Stars. Yes, it's not hard to find. <laughs> um, just getting out of the drug PSAs and just overall PSAs. Um, Forest fires. Which ones? All of them. Smokey the Bear? My only favorite thing about that is there's a um, story Mitch Hedberg tells where they don't have Smokey the Bear over in Britain. Mm. They have Smacky the Frog. <laughs> <laughs> so. Oh, wow. That's funny. I'll let him have his own joke. I'm not going to repeat it. No, here. no. Like that was respect to the great Mitch Hedberg. Respect, yeah. <laughs> but respect. Smacky the Frog is an awesome way of stopping people from yeah. starting forest fires. Yeah. <laughs> um, so many. Shit! What was the robot's name? Well, I can put my arm back on. Oh, Astar. Astar. The robot. Yeah. I can put my arm back on. You can't. It's a place safe. 
Oh yeah, that, that one. If you watch that in slow mo when he gets hit by the chainsaw that cuts his arm off, he still looks like he gets in pain. He doesn't look like that's a fun time for him. <laughs> yeah. From Planet Danger. <laughs> wow. I always thought that commercial was creepy. It was. It's supposed to scare you into like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> don't don't be dangerous. Yeah. There's one, and I swear to God, everyone's going to think I'm crazy, but it was a uh, PSA for kids to be more active inside, and what it is is a bunch of kids playing, but they all feel like they're in a video game. <laughs> oh, Jesus, that participation video. Yeah. Uh. Good, I'm not crazy. <laughs> yep. Oh, yeah, oh, is... You're crazy. It's not about this. But, no, I'd never heard of this, I don't think. It was a very rare one. Like, I caught it every so often on ABC. Huh. I think it was a participation commercial. I feel like you're right. I mean, it, like, used Mario 2 footage and just... Yeah. It's, it's like kids different. playing outside, but, like, they give video game sound effects over. Yeah. Ah. Hey, the North American House Hippo. Ah, yes. Uh that one was kind of cute. I yeah. liked it. I mean... Oh, yeah, they're trying to uh, teach kids to be careful about what they listen to. Yeah, see on TV and ask questions. Yeah. Then the other one I like is the TV one. Oh, I'm just a TV. Me. That one? Yes. <laughs> you can talk to your fans about all the weird stuff you see on TV. I can't do any of that stuff. I'm just the TV that plays it for you. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I've never seen that one. Yeah. Well, I do remember that one. It was on quite a few. It was just... Like, it was long when it came out and then they shortened it up. Yeah, it's kind of annoying when they do that sometimes. Well, it's because... Time factor. Yeah. Yeah, time is a factor when you're broadcasting. True. Oh, I got one. The one, the puppet one with the two mouses talking... Talking about cheese. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And it's in the trap. Yep. Mm. What's that up there? Is that cheese? Mm. <laughs> don't touch it if you don't know what it is. <laughs> I'm going to touch it. Runs oh. get the other <laughs> Yeah. No, we should, we should ask our parents first if it's safe to touch it. <laughs> or something like that. Yeah. You know, like your mom, your dad, or Uncle Fred. It's like Uncle Fred sounds like the last guy you really want to <laughs> ask about no. anything. Yeah, His name's Fred. No, it's just Uncle Fred. Just I don't know the full it name. Sounds is wrong. <laughs> All right. I, from my experience, my uncles have never been really reliable. All right. <laughs> yeah, sure. Go touch that. We'll see what yeah. happens. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, they were jerks. Okay. Yeah. Oh no! No, they taught them life lessons. Yeah. Don't we're listen stupid. to Uncle Fred. Yeah. <laughs> It's like, yeah, it's safe to touch. Go see what happens. <laughs> Ow! You said it was safe to touch! And you believed me. me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know the bruises are going to be the star one of this family. <laughs> Ain't going to be you. <laughs> uh, shoot, there's so many of them. Oh, yeah. And any environmentalist ones people want to get off their chest? Are there any? Oh, yeah. There are a few. I just can't remember any because yeah. I kind of don't pay attention oh. to the environmental. All right. I can't either. No, the body break PSAs? Oh, yes. Oh. Those weren't real. I thought those were advertisement for body break. No, they are just PSAs for, for people to like, get out and get active. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Wow, I really misunderstood. I thought that Body Break was a show, and these were just like small little advertisements to, for the show. Yeah, no, like, <laughs> I, I thought I thought that too until like no, because false advertising. There's no, you wait and there's like no show. 
Bert and Gert, the uh, two rabbits. No! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> okay, you just open up. Stay like, alert. Stay, stay safe. safe. Like, oh, damn it, those damn things. Oh, yes. What? You know, there was actually a. I think those were actually parts of a full video. Um, yeah. Our mm -hmm. uh, school had them. Yeah. Oh, wow. So uh, they were actually a thing. Yeah, well, my aunt was the vice principal, so. Yeah. <laughs> you have to stay alert at home, too. Yeah. Jeez, make your kids. Make your kids paranoid, why don't you? Pretty much. Yeah. The other thing that made those funny was I was watching Tiny Toons when they came on. Uh, ah, yeah! So I was watching a show, cartoon about <laughs> two buddies and a female rabbit, and then these two come up. Yeah. And I was like, Buster and Dad's growing up? Oh. Oh, no. Great. The teenage years. Great. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Babs is gonna be. Yeah, let's not go any further. <laughs> Um, what would the ones that you know talk about like Canada stuff also be PSAs? Oh, the heritage mm -hmm. moments. Yeah. Um, uh, not really because they're not okay. public service announcements. No, they're just okay. more like fun. It's like, hey, fun here's history. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, the, uh, I'm about to be in a bad accident. Oh, yeah. It was like, the, I'm getting married. The famous one is the, uh, chef. She's, uh, working and she's telling about her life story. It's like, I'm going to be married next week. Unfortunately, I won't be able to attend my wedding. Because I'm about to be in a tragic accident. Mm -hmm. See, someone left the, I didn't clean up the grease on the floor. And the stove was way too close to the, yeah. And then she slips, falls, and spills boiling hot water on her. And she almost becomes Two Face. Yeah. Oh, wow. That's. And uh, it's. Pretty it's disturbing. About, yeah, it's for work safety. Which. Like, yeah, we get it. We get it, but you my know, God, you guys part. took that to an 11. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is that the one where she has blood in her face? Yeah. All right. There really are no accidents. Uh, yes. I've never seen that. I don't want to. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, we're going to show you. Oh, yeah. No. The only reason I brought up this topic is so we can torture Cody later. Yep. Clockwork Orange, I'm writing. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> you bastard. <laughs> oh, dude, Brad got himself on being a bastard. You really should. You're pretty useless as one. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Any other ones you found there, David? Well, I do not TV, but remember the Narc game? Yes. And which one? The original one or the 2005 remake? Original. <laughs> Prevent drugs by killing people. Pretty much. Mm. That was the game. <laughs> it was like reverse Grand Theft Auto. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and Mr. Big is a fucking giant head on a... some metal thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it, doesn't he turn to a skull at some point? I think so. So. Yep. Turns into a skull. <laughs> it's, it's just a, a weird way. You know, that's a weird way to promote anti-drug whatever. Oh, boy. <laughs> so, guys, thinking about these PSAs, did they work? I mean, let me just say. <laughs> In your honest opinion, yes. Let's be honest here. No. As a kid, yes. As a kid, yes, they scared me. Yeah? Now? No. Not so much. No. Oh, 
Oh god, the other one I remembered is the Cantosaurus. It's a British one, and it's a cartoon where all these uh, alligators are wearing pants. And it's a stupid song that's so catchy that you just, uh, when you hear it, it's going to be stuck in your head forever. Alright. And it's basically just telling you, like, what's in your pants belongs to you. And if anyone ever wants to ask, see what's in your pants, you tell them no. <laughs> it's like an anti-molestation yeah. PSA. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I I figured that part out. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> dude, like, is it that bad? We really got to tell our kids through dancing. I think the guy sorcerers or alligators. I can't tell which. Yeah. Oh Christ! You made me look. You remind me of those Sonic says PSA. Yes. If someone it, touches you, that's no, no good. good. <laughs> but that was the first one. Yes. Right at the bed. It's like. What's the most important thing we need to, need to teach our kids? Not to get molested! <laughs> <laughs> okay, Jim, do you want to tell us something about your childhood? Any <laughs> <laughs> deep scars you want <laughs> fixed? <laughs> oh. <laughs> need a few days off for therapy there, Jim? <laughs> All the other ones were just simple. It's like, don't... Don't put your Walkman on high... On high... Enjoy nature... Clean up after yourself, and then pedophilia. Yeah, to avoid to get molested. <laughs> wow, you, you really cranked that one up. <laughs> yeah, especially if he's, the guy's name is Lester. Yeah. <laughs> is that an actual thing, or are you just trying to make a bad joke? <laughs> some reason, I was a bad joke, but what surprised me that that would have been the, an uh, ad. Lester the molester. <laughs> yeah. <I'll say. laughs> Yeah, well, that they can't do any. Uh, well, at least in Canada, they can't do any more anti uh, pot smoking. <laughs> no, but. <laughs> They'll probably still try. Yeah, it's like Certain nothing's people. stopping them from showing that. Yeah. What do you do? <laughs> like, this is nothing. <laughs> this is your meth. This is your meth dealer. This is your meth boyfriend. This is your meth. Baby, <laughs> and here's where you'll be living in this meth house. <laughs> Cooking. Oh, and, oh, and who's that knocking at your door? Oh, it's the it's the SWAT team. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? You're gonna resist arrest? Okay. <laughs> okay, I didn't. Yeah, yeah I didn't go that far, Cody. Once again, I ended up on a little funny humor. Yeah, Co and Cody ruins it. Yeah. That's like, like he ruined his yeah. parents' lives. Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, so the PSAs, clever, not always hitting their mark. Yeah. No. But yeah. at least they're memorable. Memorable. Oh, yeah. Which is what they're supposed to be. Yeah. The best thing that can be is memorable. The right, wrong reasons. For the, yeah, if it was for the right reasons, it'd be great. But usually, we remember them for the wrong reasons. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Well, with that, guys, we're going to call this one. It's going to be a short uh, topic. But thank you all for listening. This is a Starman's debate. Uh, don't do drugs. <laughs> I'm your host, Devin. I'm Cody. Have a great night. Billy, dang it. David, don't text and drive. <laughs> Have a good one, guys. <laughs> <laughs> really? Don't text and drive? <laughs> yeah. Trying to keep it current. Yeah, yeah fair enough. Drink some water.